Uh, we've lost my friend here's kits, DJI four, uh, F450 uh, in a um, field behind us. We look for it, we can't see it. Uh, it's brightly lit, but the grass might be too long. So we are gonna use for the first time in anger our tracker 433 millihertz uh, made by PMB New Zealand. That's a case I had to make. This I know is you a, can't see that on camera. This is a UHF uh, detector. So let's see if we got well, a We signal. can't hear a LiPo alarm or anything like that. So, uh, yeah. Oh, also, there are cows in this field, which yeah. we came face to face with earlier. Uh, uh, yeah, that, yeah. I can't, we yeah. can't actually see them now. So we're not scared of cows. But there were a lot of them, and they came at us running. Like I heard, come running that 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 AD. He ran at yeah. them with a, like a bushman with a stick. <laughs> they did run the other way then. But right, we're going to go out and test this. See if we can get this working. So we're now out in the field of which we spoke with the uh, what was it? PMB New Zealand. PMB New Zealand four three three megahertz. Uh, lost model tracker it's called. Oh, that was a beat. We've got the tracker out and we've got a signal. Uh, we've got a part antenna on this, it's not as long as the normal antenna but the range is good for 15 kilometres. Uh, now if I demonstrate over here, we're getting very little. And then over here it's good. Then over here, Oh, that was pretty good actually. Right, oh, it's pretty good to, to right over there. Right, let's turn the attenuation on. Uh, right, that's maximum attenuation both switches forward. So we've got a good signal there. Not much there, that's where we're fading out. So now I'm going to turn on the cow and so. bull tracker. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this feels to feel the scary cows, by the way. Right, so that is our centre point there. So I think, right, we walk that way. Uh, now, if we turn the squelch off, what happens now? Well, Let's I don't turn know if that's squelch. Basically, you turn it is. This you is turn squelch. squelch up until right. right. Now you should be able to. Uh, right, there that's we go. what squelch that's does. It. The track has taken us quite close to where it is. The signal's now coming from everywhere, and I think I can actually hear the tiny beacon signal that is on it. We can hear it. I heard it as you said. I think I think we did. I basically I turned round with this, using my body as a shield, with the aerial disconnected, and it gave me a very definite "it's over there" signal. I turned and faced that way, and I think I can actually hear the CR two hundred three two powered beeper going off. So it's here somewhere. Right. We switch this off and just no, no, no. The beep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Switch it off. Yeah. Right. Let's stop and listen. Just a big torch. Put it on high beam. Hang on, hang on, just, just, just a sec. Here Wait. Oh, this is a bit too close to the river. Hang on. Wait, wait. There. Where? Here. Stop, stop, stop. Here. Yeah. Here, isn't it? We are so close. Why isn't the lifeboat going off? Dude, you found it. Found it. Really fucking trod on it. Why? So that's a fucking win for that tracker. Oh well, my god! Lost an you lost arm. A wow! Arm. I lost a motor, an arm, and everything. Dude. Paul Beale, New Zealand. You are a legend. I've found my craft and my GoPro. Thank you. Shut the. What's it called? PMB New Zealand tracker. Thank you. Five minutes. Well, here is the rest of it. It's in two bits. Wow. Dude, that came down so hard. And none of the ro rotors no, are loose. I've watched a lot of videos. I've never seen that. Dude, I've never I just dramatically that. lost control. There's a cow trodden on that. Yeah, maybe. No, that's an impact crack. In two places. That's unbelievable, isn't it? Wow. Wow. <laughs>